Uh, 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 thanks very much, uh, uh, PM, uh, Acting Premier, colleagues, uh, Michael Azarak, but above all else to our amazing researchers. This precinct is home to some of the world's great researchers. It's named after a Nobel laureate. And Melbourne will be a global centre of mRNA research and manufacturing. Victoria will be a global centre of mRNA research and manufacturing. Australia will be a global centre of mRNA research and manufacturing. On top of this agreement, there's a $25 million MRFF research mRNA clinical trials infrastructure program, which we're opening. Um, and that will invite more work right across Australia. So all of these things come together for health security, economic security and national security. The fact that we have a regional headquarters and the ability to support our regional partners across the Pacific and Southeast Asia says that we're committing to the region over the long term. Now, the other thing that's really important, of course, is that uh, Australians have stepped forward and been vaccinated. And uh, we've just had uh, over 150,000 vaccinations yesterday, the highest day uh, since November the 12th. Uh, the highest day, the record day for boosters, as the PM said, uh, 74,000 boosters, a near doubling uh, of uh, the previous highest uh, day for boosters. We know how to do this. This pandemic will bring challenges. It's done that. But our results as a country are some of the best in the world. And only yesterday, Australians stepped forward to be vaccinated. So if you haven't had your booster, now's the moment if you're eligible. And if you still haven't had a first dose or a second dose, come and join the 93.4% of Australians that have had a first dose. Uh, these vaccines can save your lives and protect your lives. I can say I had the Moderna booster two days ago. I'm feeling fit and healthy. Uh, and so that's my message. Come and get your booster. Uh, it, uh, it won't hurt, but it will help. And so take care, everybody, and uh, step forward. I do also want to acknowledge uh, Robin Bishop, who donated his time to the, uh, the Commonwealth and Victoria and worked as a, a wonderful partner between uh, Moderna, uh, the Commonwealth Government and uh, the Victorian Government. It's been a real partnership of public, private, philanthropic and uh, Australians will be better protected over the long term. Thank you. Thanks, everyone. Um, Prime Minister, Acting Premier, uh, colleagues, Michael, uh, to you and your team from Moderna, um, we open our arms to you and welcome you to Victoria. Um, I'd like to also recognise our extraordinary scientific community, our scientific advisory group who have supported uh, our mRNA ambitions uh, and indeed all the industry partners who have so much to offer here in Victoria. Uh, like the Commonwealth, we are investing significantly in mRNA uh, research capability with a, a grants program uh, now open for research grants, $23 million. We established mRNA Victoria. Uh, we have worked closely and will continue to do so uh, with science uh, and with industry. There are only uh, two organisations on the planet that can currently uh, perform end-to-end -end mRNA uh, COVID-19 vaccines. And um, having Moderna uh, pitching tent, as Michael said, uh, here is so important to us. It's something uh, we're incredibly proud of and something that we value deeply. Um, we're excited about that sovereign capability, but we're also very, very excited about the research partnerships that will flow from this into things like diseases that affect parts of our region uh, into uh, the new and emerging therapeutics uh, for things like cancers and other rare diseases. Um, this is a very, very significant moment um, in the history of medical research uh, for uh, this precinct here, um, of which we are so proud, and for Moderna. And so we are um, delighted now to be moving on to the next very busy and important stage to ensure that for both our Commonwealth uh, government partners uh, and, uh, and Moderna, this is a 
successful endeavour uh, delivered very quickly and realising all the hopes and ambitions that all of us that have been involved in it have for it. Thanks very much.